Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to our online daily devotion. And the uh, title of my sharing today is God's Word is Precious. And the scripture is taken today from Psalms 119 verses 72 from the NIV. It goes this way. The law from your mouth is more precious to me than a thousands of pieces of silver and gold. You know, my first question to you is, how important is the Word of God to you? Is it just another storybook? Or is it just another historical book? Is it a book that you find it hard to relate to, to your everyday life, and hard to even understand? Or is it something far more than that? Psalms 119 verse 72 actually shows us the true value of God's word. The psalmist here expressed that the law of God, that is God's word, is far more precious to him than silver or gold. I mean, if you think about it, it can seem a bit strange. Why would anyone consider valuable or precious over a set of laws? But the word translated here as law is the word Torah. And it can mean law or regulation, but it also means teaching or instruction. The psalmist is here is saying that God's instruction to him is far more valuable than anything in this world has to offer. To be honest, okay, let's just give you an example, okay? I'm sure if we are given the choice, if let's say we can memorize God's word, and uh, we are asked to memorize God's word. And upon doing so, we will be rewarded with a large X amount of money. Wouldn't you and I want to do it? I believe many of us would gladly do it. I mean, easy peasy, right? Who doesn't want uh, an instant handout? So that's the question then is, what's more important to us? Money or God's word? Psalms 119, 72, it encourages to prioritize the word. So the question is not whether we can or cannot memorize the scripture. The question is, how much do we value? Uh, do we see in God's word? Which do we value more? God's word, money, or something else? Many today, we put uh, effort in valuing so many things in life. You know, our time, our family, our career, our future prospect. But if we truly consider the things that really matter, it has to be God's word. Bible says that heaven and earth will fade, but God's word will still remain. Bible also says that men shall not live by bread alone, but every word that comes out from the mouth of God. Think about it carefully. How can we wisely manage all these things, all these things that we value, so much so that, but without giving enough time to God's word in order to instruct us, to tell us what to do, to guide us. So church, probably we need to reprioritize again. God's word needs to come first. So today, I just want to encourage you based on the value of God's word clearly expressed in Psalms 119 verse 72, that we would probably uh, try to memorize it, to hide it in our hearts, knowing that it is far more better than any goal, any treasure, and is far better than money itself. God bless you and you have a great week.